Right, Megan and Keegan, Rainbow owners say not only is the flooding an inconvenience, but they told us they lost hundreds of customers today. And this is going to cost tens of thousands of dollars to fix. Rainbow Natural Grocery in Fondren forced to close its doors for business on Tuesday after a heavy downpour Monday night flooded the building. This is one of our worst floods. I mean, it came through the back door, the walls. Luke and Charlotte Lindemo, former CEOs of Rainbow and owners of the Fair Trade Green Store, one of the businesses inside of Rainbow's building, say since 2002, that building is flooded more than 30 times. A building addition was done without the proper permitting um, studies, and it caused the water problem. The city uh, approved that permit. But it, it wasn't, it's the city's fault because it wasn't properly um, investigated. The Lindemos told us Jackson City crews have been back twice to try and fix the problem. They say the last time was two years ago. Back then, they say they were told it would only flood once every five years. This is the fourth flood already this year. In 2017. Right. And Demo says every time this happens, the cleanup costs up to $30,000. Plus, we have all the lost business and the building gets degraded. What do you want the city to do? They should really reimburse Rainbow for all of its losses. Because the building is crippled like this now, um, I think they should buy the property at, at a fair market price and then give Rainbow a lease of two to four years so that they can have time to relocate to someplace that doesn't flood. Now, we did reach out to Mayor Lumumba's office today. They told me they were looking into this. As of right now, we haven't heard back from them just yet on some more information. For now, live in Fondren and Parker 16, WAPT News.